Now, we have done planning. There are five functional management. Yes, like I informed you, the second functional management is organizing. Organizing means harmonious adjustment of resources. Now, it leads to creation of organization structure, designing of specific rules, defining interrelationship between different personnel, and then clarify authority and relationship and responsibility among different personnel. Now, still, there are four steps in organizing. Firstly, identification and doing the work. We have to identify and divide the work accordingly. So that we have to identify and divide the work so that a smaller uh, division of work should be there so that there should be no repetition of work and each one knows uh, what he has to do. Then departmentalization, departmentalization grouping of do, do, grouping of activities of similar uh, similar nature. Like for example, uh, financing is there, uh, then the production is there and marketing is there. So these are the various uh, uh, groups. They, they similar nature should be divided among that. Then assignment of duty, we have to assign the duties among different practical examples in school also. Whenever there is a function or <coughs> duties are divided and whenever like take an example like uh, uh, Sundial sir, Sundial sir is head of a mathematics department because he experienced he is specialized in that department. So we have different departments where different uh, duties are assigned to different person. Now then as establishing this reporting relationship uh, between different personnel, each and everyone should know what he has to do, whom he has to order, and from where he has to get order from, and what are his responsibilities, and who he is accountable to. Thank you.